uh, buyers, sellers. We're talking about sellers. sellers. You're a buyer guy, but we're going to talk about sellers yeah. today. Buyer let's perspective, do, though. Let's. Ooh. What do I look for? Yeah. With the buyer, a, yeah. A, with a seller with a buyer perspective. So let's get let's get into it. Tell us about it. All right. So sellers going to sell. Sell, <laughs> sellers going to sell. So when I when I think about selling your properties, if I'm a buyer's agent, what would I be going through looking for? What would I be picking apart? You know, if I was representing my buyer, if I'm going to be walking through that house, is there chips in the paint? Is there simple things that could have been done that like just kind of scream attention to detail? You know, even a light fixture that over time gets yellow, you can spray paint that thing white. It's a dollar, whatever, how many dollars to spray for a spray can of paint? You can just take them off, put them back on. Um, so those are the things like when we go to sell a house, we can just, you know, in, in, if it's a minor stuff, if it's chips and paint, I mean, that's a, that's an easy day, you know? And if it's a full paint job, you know, sometimes we can pay up front for stuff like that. Um, we just highly encourage, you know, if there's small stuff, we got to do it. If there's big stuff, then that's a different discussion. Which helps people sell their house faster for more money. Yes. Faster gets more money in their pocket. Gotcha. Yes, okay. absolutely. So then if we go into like, what is giving value like from the heart as far as that, mm -hmm. what does that mean? How does, how does that <laughs> relate to being... Uh -huh. a seller's agent or hey i'm gonna sell your house you know like what's where's that value come from well i mean we're in the business of people to like the m utmost most personal you know level i feel like of any business we're dealing with people's house it's where they spend all their time they create all their memories you know where are they going to go next we like consider timelines you know this might be their nest egg of what they're going to be retiring with um, you know it, it might be what they're going to be passing down money they're passing down their family or if they're just in need you know, and we need to get, be able to get the most money for them and serve them in a way where we're not going in a robot where it's like cash in, cash out, transaction, and you're gone. You know, we got to meet timelines. You got to be sensitive to what they need. And a lot of times we end up getting on a really personal level with our clients. And, you know, that's to me is where like really the gold's at, you know, in the relationship. So, and we like to keep all our clients, honestly, as friends, you know, we'll go have lunch and that's the way we want to live. So. Welcome to the fam. Yeah. So, Fights in the name. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> just kind of revolves on itself. <laughs> yeah, so, 